Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Please don't forget to subscribe, tap on the notification bell, comment after watching the video, and please, please don't forget to share our videos on your different social media platforms. Thank you so much. So today we are talking about tips on how to maintain long distance relationships. Well, do you have a spouse in Dubai? Do you have a spouse in America? Do you have a spouse abroad that is not so close to you? This is how you can keep your relationship. You can still keep your relationship steaming and hot when your, your spouse is very far away from you. If you try as much as possible and follow these tips on how to maintain these long distance relationships. So number one, when your partner is very far, please try to communicate to them all the time. Communication is the key to keeping a relationship. So it doesn't matter whether he's very far or whether she's very far, you still have to keep communication very steaming. Keep on talking to him or her. Tell them about what has transpired in your life during the day. It keeps you both engaged and updated about each other's lives. So that is number one, communication. So number two, please, talk dirty. Mm -hmm. You know that song, Talk Daddy to Me. This relationship is really hard to keep since he's very far, but it's really simple to keep. As long as you talk, you have those moments. You talk daddy to each other through messages, through FaceTime videos, call each other on WhatsApp, call it, your, uh, each other like on Facebook, keep on talking to each other, have these private moments together. You can still do that. <clears throat> that like privately together on phone so this keeps the relationship steaming so he keeps on expecting more and more and more of you and you keep on bringing up new things in your relationship through those daddy talks okay so this you have to keep this going till he comes back so that he expects more and more you keep him on his toes you get it, ladies? Basically, ladies. And well, yeah, also for the men, please talk that it's your spouse when they're abroad and they're so far away from you. Remember, they can't touch you. Okay. And also, ladies, now this is to the ladies, always video chat with him or video chat with him in a sexy way. It that, you don't need to be ordinary like you're always with him. Well, this time around is different. He's very far. So you need to keep your relationship steamy. Put in a sexy dress. Talk to him in a sexy way. Talk daddy to him. Actually, always be sexy when you're talking to your spouse. If he is very far. And also to the men. Yeah, men, you can also be sexy. When your wife is very far, please be sexy. Talk to her in a sexy way. These are some of the ways you can keep them anticipating for you and wanting you more and more and more. Number three, always... Avoid dangerous situations. Take an example. You cannot go out, have fun with friends, take a lot of beer, do crazy things with your girlfriends without talking to your spouse first. Well, he's very far, but you still have fun. So it's so easy keeping this relationship. If you communicate, tell him, let him know a day before and let him know that you're having a girl's day out so that he doesn't think otherwise. Remember, Social media is social media. You go out and post these pictures or your friends will post these pictures. And he, if he doesn't know or have any idea of where you are, he'll think otherwise. He'll think someone took you out. He'll think another man took you out. So communication, let the person keep yourself away from such situations, situations that need explanations, situations that make your spouse feel insecure. Why would you FaceTime with someone else in the background and opposite sex? Why would you do that? Why would you invite your friends that are boys if you're a girl? Why would you invite your boyfriends, like boys who are friends, to your home when your spouse is very far and you still FaceTime him and he sees these people in his house? You did not inform him. These days, it's a modernized world. You can still send a gift to your spouse however far they are. Please. Always send gifts to your spouse. Every time that you receive these surprises, they are always happy and they smile about it. They're like, wow, she is even thinking about me even when I'm this side. Or, oh, 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 he's thinking about me even when I'm this far. Well, yeah, those gifts will keep their hearts pumping, thinking about you. So don't forget, you have to share these gifts however much they are very far. There are so many companies doing that. So use these companies, send those gifts 
Let your husband or boyfriend know that you're still thinking about them, however much they're very far. Avoid unnecessary conversations. Well, there are so many unnecessary conversations that bring about arguments. Avoid arguments. So, avoid those conversations. Because when you have those conversations, the little arguments. And then it's very, very not good having arguments with your partner very far. Because if the partner was so close, it's so easy to like bridge the gap. But since the person is very far and you have an argument, it's so hard to bridge that gap after the argument. So avoid having those unnecessary conversations that lead to Arguments, ways of maintaining these re- long distance relationships, really simple, though very hard if you don't know. So please follow this. Avoid such situations. Avoid, avoid not communicating. You have to communicate to your spouse. It don't matter how far he is. You can use a text. You can use a call. So there are so many other ways of how to keep these long distance relationships steaming. So those are some of the ways you can keep or maintain your relationship, your long distance relationship. I know there are so many other ways, so please comment down there. Tell us, for those of you who know, please let us find ways of maintaining long distance relationships for those who are having those spouses very far away. So you can still have a relationship. It don't matter whether he's for you, can still have a relationship. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, tap on the notification bell, comment. Give us more tips and also ask if you have a question about it, please be free to ask. I'll be very happy to reply. So thank you very much. Subscribe. I love you. Peace.